Hi everybody, it's Wayne from PT. I'm at my house um, and today I'm going to show you how to plant some seeds. So the first thing that you'll need is some soil. I actually have already poured the soil into this pot. Um, the second thing you're going to need is water. Sorry for any background noise you may hear. I live beside like a very busy road. Um, but yeah, so the third thing you're gonna need is some seeds. And these seeds are kind of special because we have we have four cats and they really like these seeds every, sp uh, every spring and summer. Um, they're called Smarty Cat Sweet Greens. Um, they're a type of oat seed. Um, that are easy to grow and cats just really enjoy them and really enjoy eating them and playing in them so we're gonna grow those you're gonna kinda wanna look at your seeds to make sure that they're you know looking looking good looking good seeds and then you're gonna so just like in a big garden you're gonna want to make rows for your seeds to kinda lay in before you cover them with soil so I'm gonna make two rows for my seeds I probably need to get rid of some of this excess dirt I kind of filled it up too much but I'm gonna make two rows for your seeds and you're gonna kind of want to spread them out a little bit. You see all the seeds? And you're going to want to make sure that they're kind of still in that line. Um, and if the soil gets in the way, just kind of push it back. There you go. And it's okay if they're bunched up on top of one another, because um, not all of your seeds are going to grow. So we're just going to kind of spread those out a little bit, make sure it goes all the way because we want as much seed in there as possible. There you go. And then you're going to want to cover them up. Like that. To where no seed is showing and they're about a fourth of an inch underneath the soil okay so then you're going to take your water and the directions on the packet say not to give it too too much water so we're just gonna just kind of moisten the top here um, and since it's a big pot you're just going to kind of want to water all over as much as you can um, the soil was really dry, so it's going to take a minute for it to soak up. So if you see any excess water on top, that's normal. Um, yeah. So it says that these it says that these seeds take about it says every few weeks. So it's only going to take a few weeks for these seeds to grow. Um, it's not a hard turnaround for the seeds. And they even tell you to um, use it as potting soil for the next time or as compost. Um, because your cats are going to wreck these seeds. So don't worry if you have cats. Um, if you don't have cats and you want to plant something else, um, it's really easy to do. It's basically just like this. So, And we also have plant food that I'm just going to kind of stick in here randomly and this will help to nourish your soil um, as time goes by just to make sure your plants stay healthy and these seeds in particular they have to stay indoors for a little while um, to really we call it germinating the seeds so whenever the seeds are moistened and start to grow and then whenever you see sprouts you can
take it outside because that means they're healthy enough to live outside for a little while. So there you have it. That is how you plant seeds. So my challenge to you all is if you can plant something, please do and put it in the comments. And if you can't, then please write about your favorite part of nature. Thank you.